Hey everybody, it's Pastor Miguel from the Children's Bed Delivers Ministry here in Maryland. And today I want to answer a question that's very common. It has to do with what do demons look like? First of all, let me say that demons do not look at all like a man, okay? They do not look like us. They rebelled against God and they hate everything that has to do with, with us, okay? So we are made in the image of God. This is one of the reasons why they hate us. In addition to the fact that they have no redemption. Okay, we have redemption, but they don't have any redemption at all, okay? Since we are made in the image of God and they hate God and men, then we must conclude that demons do not look like men. All right? They don't look like us. In fact, angels may not even look like us either. Right? We read from the Bible that there are some angels that have four faces. An example of this is the cherubim. Okay? Satan was a cherubim. All right. He had uh, four faces. He had the face of a man, a face of an ox, uh, a face of a lion, and a face of an eagle. Okay, There are also angels that have eyes over their bodies. This is what the Word of God tells us. However, we know from the Bible that angels can take the form of men when they need to. So when God sends them in an assignment, you know they're able to take the form of men. We don't find this with demons and, and falling angels. Okay, we don't find um, we don't find any falling angel taking the the body or the form of a man um, in in the Bible. Okay. Interesting enough, Paul states that we may entertain angels without knowing it. So there's a possibility that you may be uh, speaking to an angel and not even know it. Okay. The Bible does say that Satan may manifest as an angel of life. But there's nothing that stays in the Bible that there's manifestations of Satan as a man. All right. So we see from um, from some of these, uh, for example, Muslim religion, and Muslim, yeah, Muslim and uh, Mormons, how they had angels. These things manifested as an angel. Um, it was not as a man. We see, um, uh, you know, uh, Moroni and uh, supposedly the angel Gabriel uh, showed up and. Uh, gave revelation uh, to these uh, supposedly um, prophets or or supposedly men of God, and they received this re revelation, and they gave them a gospel that goes contrary to the gospel that Jesus Christ gave us. And the Bible says, uh, "Let them be a curse if anybody was to give you a, a, a gospel that goes contrary to the gospel that we have, even if it's an angel of light." Okay, so we're warned against those things. Okay. We know from ministry that some things, some of these demons manifest as snakes. They have large tongues, some are hairy, others have scales in their bodies. They have horns and hooves. They have claws. Some have dark and red eyes uh, like fire. Uh, so they manifest usually as some type of beast, mystical. It could be a dragon. It could be a giant snake. So they manifest as these, as these uh, mystical uh, beings, okay? So I think I made it clear that demons do not look like 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 men. Okay, they they do not. They rejected God, and as a result, they don't want anything to do with God or anything that looks like God. So if you have any questions, you can place it below. I'd be happy to answer your question. Thank you for watching. Please share and subscribe to our channel. Uh, share this video, uh, and God bless you. And I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye bye.